Hi friends, in our continuing search for quality programming here at the Count's 90s Bedtime Stories, we feel we need to be a little bit more inclusive. Since most of these stories were ones that I read my sons when they were little, they mostly skewed to a certain type of story. There were other great characters out there that I had missed at the time, but now I have found so that I can read them to you. Today, we'll be reading My Little Pony, Bun at the Fair. And as always, only the finest quality children's stories read by the finest quality narrator. Just kidding. But the stories are fantastic and hopefully you will enjoy these renditions. The sun was just rising over Ponyville. The ponies were getting an early start. They were going to a fair. Let's have a race, Minty squealed. The ponies ran through the meadow until they reached the fair. The friends bounded through the gate. The fair stretched as far as they could see. There was so much to do. Let's go on the bumper cars, cried Sunny Days. She shared a car with Butterscotched. They crashed into Rainbow Dash. Anyone want to try the water slide? asked Wisteria. The ponies got soaked, but they soon dried off in the warm sun. Butterscotch wanted a picture of all her friends. It would remind her of their day at the fair. The ponies crowded into a photo booth. They made funny faces for the camera. Then, Sunny Day said, let's try some games. She leapt to a row of booths. The ponies were ready to play. Minty went first. She had to jump on a platform. If she jumped hard enough, a bell would ring. Minty jumped with all her might. The bell rang. Minty won. Her prize was a cute cap. Minty's prize was stylish. But it was not what she wanted. She had her eye on a teddy bear. If Minty won at three booths in a row, she could trade in her prizes for the bear. Minty's friends were still taking turns on the platform. Minty headed for the next booth. She thought of the bear. Then she tossed a water balloon. This time she won a necklace. Minty's friends cheered her on at the next booth. You can do it, Minty, said Westeria. Pony power, shouted Sparkleworks. The third game looked easy. Minty just had to kick a ball through a goal. But she didn't win with her first kick. She didn't win with her second kick either. The other ponies decided to go on the Ferris wheel. They waved to Minty from the top. Minty was too busy to see them. Minty missed a lot of fun. Rainbow Dash went to the face painting booth. She had rainbows painted on both her cheeks. Sunny Days went on the roller coaster, and Butterscotch found lots of stickers for her scrapbooks. Minty kept on playing, but the ball always went in the wrong direction. Minty still wanted to win the bear, but she was starting to feel discouraged. Suddenly, Wisteria was beside her. I bet you're tired, she said. Maybe you just need a break. The friends shared an ice cream cone. Then they returned to the game. Now Minty was ready to try again. She took a deep breath. Then she kicked the ball. It went right into the goal. Minty had won the third prize. Minty traded her three prizes for the teddy bear. She gave the bear a squeeze. Then she gave Wisteria a squeeze, too. A friend like Wisteria was the best prize of all. And fireworks were the best end to the ponies' day at the fair. <laughs> 